This man bones. funny as hell. I understand. I don't play about my chicken either. Uh huh. Somebody. Uh uh. Mm -hmm. Crispy and crunchy. Well, wait a minute. Who raised him to eat wings like tater chips? <laughs> Bro, wait. No, seriously. You ain't got the. Uh, that chicken ain't that good. Just one more. Sir, that's a chicken wing, not a chicken nugget. Yeah, he got to be mixed with a pit bull. Lord have mercy, sir. You already... I'm not going to hold you. I'm Caribbean, so we do chew the bone. But, like, we eat the meat. Pause. Pause. Then we chew the bone and then we spit it out. Folks look like he chewed the bone with the meat. And swallow it. Pause. That whole combination sound crazy. Ah, my Jesus. Um, yeah, I get what I'm trying to say. Uh, that's that's not normal. That is not normal. Oh, 2023? 20, 20, 40. Really? You just make that up? No. Hold ish. 40 ish? For business or for pleasure? <laughs> for pleasure. When you're out on a first date with someone, how do you know if you're going to give it up to him that night or you're going to draw it out a couple dates? How hot he is. So that's all it depends is the hotness factor. Uh, yeah, I mean, if he's a d though, he's not going to get anything. 40 bodies in one year is serial killer behavior. Her pH balance is probably crazy. <laughs> I'm sorry, her pH balance was probably crazy, son. That's a lot of people. You know what? I ain't even finna judge. I ain't, I ain't even finna judge, man. It's your body. It's your life. You can do what you want to do. But when you ready to settle down and this video pops back up. If I was a woman, I would definitely sum up. Yeah? Oh, yes. Binky, you out of pocket. For free, bro. They got to pay for it. I'm going to have A1. <laughs> <laughs> How you know? Wow. Your shit? What if your shit? Nah. Bro. <laughs> nah. You look like your <laughs> would stink, bro. Nah. <laughs> nah, bro. If I was a woman, I would definitely. Hey, yo, Binky, you out of pocket. You, you out of pocket, bro. For some context, I haven't seen this man in almost 15 years. I basically grew up with him, though. Uh, I used to be in Canarsie a lot, and we used to play basketball in his backyard. Besides what he said in the video... I be so happy when I see people that I grew up with doing good for themselves. So I'm, you know, congratulations to you, bro, because y'all, y'all podcast is popping. Show me your tax returns. Show me your bank statements. Show me your face. Show me your profile. Your side profile. Show me your body, top to bottom. Do a 360. Those are the requirements for you to come for me. Those are the requirements for you to come for me. Okay, I'm not. You think I'm joking? It's the actual truth. I'm not showing you my tax returns. I'm not showing you my bank statements. Now, everything else she said, I can understand. Show me your face. Show me your body. I can understand that because folks be out here catfishing. But I'm not showing you my, my financial information. Why would I do that? Sure, all right. If, if that, bring me the pussy facts. How about that? Bring me the facts. How many bodies you got? Why are you single right now? I, I want to know. I, you know how they got car facts? I wish people came with personal facts. Prove it because you all made a mistake? Not really, no. So you want to get mad and hit the computer because you made a mistake? Because your company made a mistake? You want to take it out on me? I'm not taking it out on you. So why did you get mad and hit the computer? Why did you get mad and hit the computer? I'm shooting you on camera, right? Yeah, I am. I'm sick of that I'm having a mental break. Oh, my. Oh my. Oh my. So this is the type of people that have working here. Oh my. Wow. You gotta be kidding me. Yo. Yo, 
Wow. Yo. Hey. Prove it because. I don't know if any of y'all are going to agree with me. But. Sometimes we need to learn to read the room. Now I know he's in a professional setting. And his personal issues should not come to play in the personal setting. But listen to me. You can clearly see that this man is on the verge of a mental breakdown. He said it. He said, because I'm having a mental... And then this dude kept on talking, and he did what he did. If you come in a situation where somebody's self-harming themselves, that's a sign of um, a mental illness. That's a sign of a mental illness. I hope, I hope homie get help, dog. I hope homie get help. Papa. Hey, calling another grown ass woman Papa is crazy, okay? But this had this video brings up an interesting question that I've wondered: How often do dudes disrespect lesbian relationships? Me as a man in a heterosexual relationship, sometimes I'll go out with my wife, and I'm already prepared for to be disrespectful. It's one thing for somebody to look, but sometimes dudes cross that line of scrimmage and you have to prepare for that. You have to you have to mentally prepare yourself sometimes, especially if your wife might have a big butt. Like I'm not going to lie, my wife got a big butt. So sometimes I have to mentally prepare myself. I, right, you know, dudes are going to look. But I often wonder, but but I do feel as though it's certain lines don't cross simply because I'm a man. So I often wonder how, like, you know, lesbians be feeling when they walk out with their girlfriends. Like, when studs go out with their girlfriends, like, what level of mental preparedness do they have to have just in case a dude is looking or a dude trying to talk to their girl? You feel me? Because some is not going to respect y'all relationship simply because you a woman dating another woman. Like, is they don't fear you. They don't feel as though, oh, she going to beat my ass. So they don't feel as though you're going to beat their ass, so they're going to cross that line of scrimmage disrespectfully. Wait, here's something crazy that I thought about. Now, I'm not trying to make no excuses for people that want to snip their stuff and chop their breast off. I ain't trying to make no excuses for them. But at the, at the same time, it's your body, it's your life. You can do what you want to do, right? But do y'all believe in reincarnation? Right? Suppose... Dudes who are born and feel as though they are women are actually Rosales Guadalupe. Who the hell is this? Hello? Rosales Guadalupe. Wow. That that's God telling me that I'm finna say some bullshit, so I'm gonna stop. That's what that was. Who? <laughs> that's what that was. That's God telling me, shut the f up. You finna say some BS. I'm in Jamaica. Oh my God. <laughs> Yo, is that brick? Yo, brick lady got. Brick by brick, pun intended, because four months ago when this incident happened. Yeah, hold on, 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 hold on. I ain't no brick lady had body like that. I know I'm being immature, but at the same time, I am a man. I didn't I didn't know Brick Lady had all that back there, bro. That thing look hefty. Alright, let's get it out of the way, cause she crazy, so. 
happened, I was afraid to check my mailbox. Uh huh. I didn't think that I could ever go out by myself. And as a okay. woman that has been on her own since she was 16 and has traveled over 20 countries and uh -huh. most of them by herself, that was just so depressing. She long winded at me saying a lot of nothing. Here I am on a solo trip that I decided five days ago that I was going to go on. And I'm here and I feel protected, divinely protected. And I wish that for all black women across the diaspora because black women, we created this world. Uh -huh. We deserve to explore it. We deserve to enjoy it, we deserve to see it, and this is just a big deal, like, this is progress, and I'm so proud of myself for doing this, and I'm trying to learn how to live my life safely and enjoy it, I may never be the carefree girl I once was, but I am on a different foundation, and I'm solid as me. I'm in Jamaica! Hey, the recoil on that thing was crazy. Just like her crazy ass. But um, Brick Lady is crazy, man. If y'all ain't heard about Brick Lady, bro, Brick Lady basically came out and said that somebody hit her in the face with a brick. Now, I actually have a video that I'm working on about this because right now, the city of Houston has a warrant out for her arrest because they're saying that she fake the story, and she also was trying to get, get people to send her money on GoFundMe over false allegations. I'm not going to lie, I, doing my research, things is looking a little iffy because she actually did get hit in the face with a bottle. And my thing is, if she did get hit in the face, why is she getting charged? But at the same time, they have pulled up other known evidence of her lying. And this is a perfect example of the boy who cried wolf. In this situation, the girl who cried wolf. So I don't know. I'm going to do some more research before I just come out and start doing videos on the situation. But I just got off the phone with this guy, bro, because I was like, it's time to get back in these streets. You feel me? Like, And so I FaceTime people before I meet them. Why he call me a weirdo? I'm not weird. Guys, am I weird? I'm not weird, bro. What is he talking about? What is he talking about? Nobody, nobody's, nobody agrees with that. Nobody agrees with that shit. I'm not weird. I've never been weird. I'll never be weird. Like, that's rude. I'm normal. <laughs> I'm very normal. What the fuck? You don't even believe that. so hard like what? like I'm gangster bro what the fuck <laughs> I just got when I used to date I used to think it was weird that people want to text all day like if me and you were just talking I want to talk on the phone my personality comes out through the phone like I hate texting that's that's one reason I feel as though if if I was to Go back out here in these streets, like, God forbid, knock on wood, knock on wood. If me and my wife wasn't to work out and I had to go back out here in these streets, I would have a hard time dating, because one, these heifers be expecting too much, and two, that whole texting all day, I don't like to text, like, I want to talk. If we getting to know each other, we got to talk on the phone. Texting don't do it for me. Am I weird for that?